Good morning. This is a quick review of the Ascaria uh, writing style. Uh, so first you go to scimatic.org and then you log in or a register, same thing. Uh, you can use Facebook or Gmail. I use Facebook. So we don't need your uh, password extra here. Uh, we use Facebook API to log in you. Then go to manuscripts and start new manuscript from here. Then give a name. It can be anything. My paper and just select any journal which you want. So let me select this one and I'm writing in English. We have five languages and in here select Ascaria style manuscript template and then create new manuscript and I will write a research article. So let's proceed. And here is an empty paper. Uh, we have nothing written nothing yet here. So let's create a PDF and see. How it look like. So this is an empty template. Uh, you see nothing here. And then let's come back here and give some head and author. So I will select myself uh, and you, you need to select this one for corresponding author. I select uh, myself as a corresponding author and then come to title. Here is a test article for Ascaria template. Okay and I will copy this text because it will be a quick so you need to copy this many times. And just make some abstract and add some keywords. Uh, chemistry, let me be quickly chemistry, physics, biology, maths. They're not real, just test paper. And uh, let's say English. Come to introduction, just paste some text here and now the important part is coming so save the paper and then I will add one uh, image and one table to this paper so come to introduction or whatever you just click this one uh, this for figures so add new figure this one add new figure choose the file Um, I will choose from my computer just some random files. Uh, let's say this one and give a title for this image. What should be uh, under below or below this image? So this is a test image for the Scaria style and just add new. And let's see how it looks like. So we use a drag and drop system. Uh, click introduction and I will paste the image here. So come to the images again figures and just drag and drop. Oh sorry. Just drag and drop here. Okay. And save. And then you will see how this image look like. And then we will add uh, a table after this. So okay now let's see the pdf in the meanwhile i will just show you table here a table so you see you click uh, add new table and then like image we'll add a table so here is the article opening yes so come here this is the abstract this introduction here is the image and below the image uh, you see automatically uh, figure one uh, is put by the system and here is the uh, image title okay so let me add uh, a table a quick table uh, so add new table and we have few ways I will just give some name table 
table one or anything x x this is a test table for scaria scaria template okay now we have two ways one to create here uh, let's say uh, I will make from here I don't prefer this way but just turn to anything and uh, click OK and we have a table and just fill it file name x66 why will I just fill something and don't do anything else okay just a table this is the first way save it another way is to create your table in Microsoft Word and then paste here so let's let me show you in the introduction uh, I will paste some text here and then I will pay I will just uh, drag and drop this table here save it and then we will check the PDF saved now let's check the PDF and meanwhile I will show you I have created a table in the Microsoft Word so I will show you that okay it's like this one uh, the, the PDF is ready let's see the PDF first and come here and see Here's the table. It's not look, looking nice too much, and I will show you how to make it more uh, nice and fancy. Uh, in the meanwhile, come to Microsoft Word, and I have a table here. So I will copy it and paste in the, uh, not paste here. Let me create a new table and then table x6 you can write anything just for your information I will, for the time being I just write something and paste the table here okay so don't do anything for now just save it and then we will add this table as well so let me get some text from here And then here I will add this next table, this one. Okay, so just drag and drop and save. And then we will see in the PDF how it looks like, and then I will show you how to make them looking better. So it's completed now, and let's see the PDF. And in the meanwhile, uh, let's see the PDF first. The PDF is ready. Okay, so this is the next table, and here is table two, uh, uh, paced by the system automatically. Uh, okay, and here is table one. So let's make them uh, some fancy and some formatting stuff. So just right click on this and open in the new tab. And here is the table and edit it. So click the source and remove these borders. I don't like borders, so remove borders, everything. And just right here, width 100%. Okay, uh, don't forget the quotations see now it's look like very simple but it's okay for us and save the table and then you can also do this for the next table so it did and then we are also do the same for this table so click the source and here remove these things and write width 
and also uh, one other thing you can do is remove all the styles there from from Microsoft Word so we don't need styles or you can do another thing select all and then here is a button for remove style which one is I think this one remove format remove format and then come to source and there is no format now so you come to the table and say um, width 100% what it will make it will spread the table to the whole width so now it's spread and save it and oh, and it is saving we will come here and create a PDF and now let's see how it look like you see uh, it's the table now and it look like fine uh, so this is the way of adding tables and images and what about the references <coughs> you can add references uh, different ways but let me show you a raw method a raw method is just like you you say like this one and then in the raw references you just paste like at any format you say this is the article journal of this and that and 2020 this is one way <coughs> save and then we will see the <coughs> PDF let's see the PDF how it, for bibliography or the references look like So here is our bibliography automatically put down here. You can change the uh, first capital or because it's not automatic. So if you want to add automatic bibliography, uh, what you can do is you can come here, you can add bibliography. But there are also very different ways uh, for doing it. Uh, one is manually, but it's coming soon. Uh, reference title. So let me show. Uh, let me search for some articles about the blockchain technology. If I'm writing an article on the blockchain, blockchain technology and the future, and just wait for them to bring some references to me. And there are, we have a search engine that has 200, more than 200 million articles. So you will find whatever you are looking for. Let's suppose I will add this to my bibliography and click save. And you will see here it can so if I want uh, to paste my reference here instead of automatically just drag and drop here okay and if you want them in the what is it called square parentheses just do it nothing more and save but uh, Professor Omar in the meanwhile okay so the article is saved and now let's see the PDF okay so in the text it is automatically like this you see in Italian uh, it's yellow and here Bibliography is automatically uh, rendered by the system from the uh, from the database. So this is the how we how to add bibliography and how to add table and how to add images. And we I think we have some work to do here. It will take one hour. Maybe we will do this part. Here you can see there is a Dewey uh, that is inside the text. So we we will correct that in one and two and two hours. You can keep using this uh, if you want this template uh, see you in the next video